today on the adventures of Masked Rider, Lexian sends Danaeus on a mission. This crystal will enhance Dex's powers to Masked Rider Super Gold. You must take this gift to my grandson. Greetings. King Lexian has sent me from Edenoi. This family is so weird. Then he's kidnapped by maggots. I'm not talking, Count Dragon. Can our hero rescue his friend? Dex's friends are such nice insects. Find out on the adventures of Master Rider next. Fast Rider. Fast Rider. On a distant and embattled planet called Edenoi, a young prince named Dex is given great powers by his grandfather, the king, and is sent to the planet Earth to protect it from the advancing evil of Count Dragon and his vicious insectoids. Once on Earth, he is adopted by a kind family and learns to live as a human. With his companion, Furbus, by his side, Dex is ever vigilant, ready at a moment's notice to call on his powers to become Masked Rider. It's okay, Furbus, it's me. Yeah. Silly? You really think so? Me? Well, I hope you don't mind taking part in the Founder's Day Masquerade. I enjoy participating in Earth rituals, but I'm really not sure I understand this one. Oh, well, that's simple. You see, Nathaniel Leewood was the founder of our town, and uh, he also loved masquerade parties. So once a year, everybody dresses up in honor of him. Do people really enjoy pretending to be someone they are not? I don't know, but lots of people are really good at it. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, Dex, it's for you. Get down, Furbus. I just wanted to show everyone my new costume. So, Dex, what do you think? Hmm. You need two more legs and a shiny abdomen. Then it will be an accurate imitation of a nectar-sucking blister beetle. I just wanted to know what you thought about the color. More red. I have to go now. I'm confused. Didn't she just ask for my opinion? I think she only wanted to hear a good one. Friendships on Earth are so confusing. On Edenoi, my friends and I always tell each other the truth. Dex, do you miss your friends? Yes. I miss them a lot. Danaeus, I'm afraid Count Dragon's powers on Earth are far greater than we anticipated. We must give Prince Dex the ability to increase his own powers. This crystal will enhance Dex's powers to mask Ryder's super gold. Our plans to fight Count Dragon are at a critical stage. I must not leave. Danaeus, you must take this gift to my grandson. Yes, my king. What's that? What's this piece of junk? What did they say? What good is intelligence if I can't use it? I will go to the Earth. There. Uh, he's going to help Dex. No, he's not. Because that brat, Danaeus, will never reach him. <laughs> Farewell, 
Tenaeus. I will not fail you, my king. That's your Founder's Day costume? No, I thought I'd wear it to the prom. Oh, well, it's a great costume. You really do look like a bug. What I mean is, oh, never mind. I'll see you later. <sighs> what in the world is that? Uh, 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 somebody give me up! Oh, oh great. May I be of some assistance? Huh? Would you like some help? That'd be nice. Thank you. Well, it is my pleasure for one dress so attractively. Oh, this old thing? Well, you just need two more legs and a shiny abdomen. I'll be going now. Excuse me. Uh, I'm new in your town. Uh, would you be able to tell me where I may find Prince Dex? Did you say Prince Dex? Oh, we need to talk. Now, when you say prince, are you talking about your majesty kind of prince? Uh, you know, with actually... the crown and the flowing robes and everything? Yeah, well, I knew there was something strange about Dex. <laughs> Those stupid creatures missed him! Nevertheless, my maggots will deliver Dorneus into your hands, my count. What in the galaxy leads you to that conclusion? Their track record is pathetic! The law of averages comes into play. Nefaria has to be right someday. Correct. Database indicates high probability of victory. Yes, but whose victory fact? Count Dragon's, of course. Ah, just as I've always said. Your homework. Mom, Dad, Dex and I are going to school to help decorate for Founder's Day. Okay. Purvis, come on. Money for me, money for me. <laughs> no, you stay here. <laughs> Purvis, would you like something to eat? I've got sticky buns in the oven. <gasps> money mono, money mono sticky. Hello again, Patsy. Come in. Hi, Mr. Stewart. Is, um, Prince Dex here? No, you just missed him. Did Dex decide to go with the Prince costume? Well, I thought he was going to be an astronaut. Hmm. Costume? It is of the utmost importance that I speak with him. Uh, just a home security system that Dex and I... Were, I'll, I'll, I'll turn it off. Greetings. King Lexian has sent me from Edenoi. What'd you say? My ears are still ringing. I am Donaeus. From, from Pittsburgh, no doubt, or some other city close by. Look, Barbara, I'll be. Look, it's, it's Donnie, Dex's distant cousin. Say hello to him, everyone. Hi. Another cousin? This family is so weird. Wait a minute. How do we know you're Dex's friend? I love you too, Furbis. Well, I guess that answers your question. Are you really from Aiden Eye? Affirmative. Affirmative? He's gonna have to watch more TV than Dex. <laughs> well, Dex and Molly were over at the high school. Oh, uh, what is a, a high school? Hey, Gooby, Gooby. I guess Furbis could show you the way, as long as you kept him hidden. Thank you for your assistance. We'll be careful. Dex's friends are such nice insects. Dex, 
Maybe not quite so fast. Sorry. All right, you guys. Let me show you how posters supposed to look. Perhaps this might be a good moment to practice discretion. Do my maggots would do the job. <laughs> Those who doubt it will look like jerks when the Farrier's plan actually works. Now, who? We have a guest. <laughs> Welcome home, Daenerys. So, you were Prince Dex's troublemakers. Tell me, Daenerys, why did King Lexian send you to Earth? I'm not talking, Count Dragon. What a pity. For you, that is. Your refusal means I have no choice but to turn you against the Prince. I will never fight Dex. We'll see what you say after a night of neural reprogramming and a complete memory wipe. <laughs> a memory wipe? Brilliant idea, sire. With all of his memories blown to dust, Daenerys will be one of us. You wouldn't. Recently, I've been trying to recreate the Master Rider powers for myself. Dragon, you've been holding out on me. A surprise, my darling. You like surprises, don't you? Database indicates the Master Rider powers are unstable when used for evil and may be extremely dangerous. Tell me something I don't know, you piece of floating scrap. Why do you think I need someone to test the powers before I use them for myself? No, I won't do it. <laughs> You'll never get away with this, Dragon. I'll never help you fight Mass Rider. Why does everyone struggle so much before I make them bend to my will? <laughs> oh, Dex, could you give me a lift? Sure, Patsy. I've got to go. Go where? What do you mean? Me. What about the decorations? Sorry. Grandfather. 
Yes, Stennis. Burbis tells me Danaeus has come to Earth, but Dragon had kidnapped him. This is terrible news. Danaeus was bringing you a gift that would increase your Masked Rider powers to super gold. I'm afraid that gift may now be in the hands of Count Dragon. I have to think of something, but what? For now, you must continue your Earth activities. If I know my son, he will not wait long to act. Tough break, boss. Yes, bad news. Dex, I'm so sorry. Hey, watch the paint job. Sorry. I'm apologizing to a car. You got that right. Apology accepted. Wrong. Dex, is there anything I can do? I'm afraid not. My grandfather's right. We must wait. It's time I present to you my latest triumph. The prisoner Danaeus, but he appears unchanged. Was the memory wipe successful, sir? I shall show you. Witness the power of Robo Rider. Robo Rider Force. Robo Rider, fully energized. A brilliant ploy, sire. Prince Dex would never destroy his own friend. Robo Rider is your most perfect yet. Dex, it would seem, is doomed to defeat, for here is a foe he won't want to beat. Robo Rider, destroy Master Rider. I shall do as you command, Count Dragon. I serve only you. Must destroy Mask Rider. <sighs> Attention, you will tell me where is Mask Rider? indicate he is in this structure. Just one minute, young man. The tardy bell is already rung. Do you have a hall pass? You will say, never mind. Uh, never mind. My insectopathic feeling is telling me something is very wrong. Where is Masked Rider? Who is in charge here? Answer me! May I help you? You are not Masked Rider. Therefore, you are of no use to me. For the masked rider. Tell him I am here. Send him to me at once. Single file, everyone! Single file! That bug looks like masked rider. I bet he has your powers, too. It's worse than that. How could it be worse? I recognize the voice. Count Dragon's latest warrior is my best friend. No way. Yes. It's Danaeus. Where is the mass rider? Bring it to me. Mass rider, hear me. I know that you are near. I have come for you. Why do you hide from me? Danaeus. Danaeus is no more. I am Robo Rider. Count Dragon has taken control of your mind. Let me help. 
You help me? Who are you? I am Prince Dex of Eden. Then you are doomed. <laughs> Ecto, phase, activate. I do not wish to fight you, Danaeus. But if we must, then so be it. You will be defeated. Never. I have all your powers and more. But it's dangerous to use them for evil. Dangerous, yes, but not for me. Please, Danaeus, don't do this. Enough talk! Will Lexian's plan to enhance Dex's powers fail? Will Dex get to get a better costume for Halloween? Will Dex save his best friend from Count Dragon's evil transformation? Will Patsy get a grip on gravity? Are Robo Rider's powers too great for Dex to overcome? Tune in next time for the exciting conclusion to this adventure of Masked Rider.